I was one of the early ones to get married. And Pete drove me home one night. He asked me, he said, aren't you scared? I said, not at all. This, this girl is just so great, so solid. She recognizes that I have absolutely no money, can't even buy her an engagement ring. Pete looked at me and said, Fred, he said, that's not going to happen. He says, what we're going to do, I'm going to lend you $125. And I was to go march down, if you will, to Fog Jeweler and buy her an engagement ring. After graduating, Pete squeezed in a year to pitch for the Albuquerque Dukes. These pitches were all hard and fast. I don't mind the fastballs, but I didn't mind those lousy curves. So. <laughs> Soon, Pete and Nancy married, and he began his professional career as a teacher. But with a large family in the making, Pete decided law school made better sense. Pete no sooner graduated from law school than he considered another career move. He was influenced by working downtown, and he was a lawyer, so he would ruminate with other lawyers about problems of the city. He knew what the city council was like. And he decided that he wanted to make some changes if possible. I would complain a lot about government. And I had some friends that had to listen to it. And so uh, on a given day, five of them sat me down and uh, essentially they put the question to me, will you run? No, I don't think so. Well, if you don't run, then you, you've got to quit bitching. And uh, that's pretty serious stuff. But it wasn't like we had long discussions about, uh, this is my future and what do you think about it? It was sort of like, that's what I'm going to do. And I knew he was excited about it. It's better to have an excited spouse that's working than somebody that doesn't like his job. Truth hit them sooner than it hit me, the reality. And, and they got a group together and came see me and said, we really were mistaken. Don't do it. What are you talking about? Well, you know, it's a terrible life. And you've got friends, you'll have enemies, you can have a great future, you'll be, this will be a terrible thing. You know, you did it, you asked me, so we're gonna run, you have to help me. My career as a politician began with a dare at 34 years of age, 1966, Magnuson's Restaurant, downtown Albuquerque. Pete was elected to the city commission and headed up the city commission as de facto mayor. After the war ended, we had this great influx of people that were coming in, and we didn't know them, and they didn't know us. Senator Domenici and that group that came into power at that time were very effective in getting all of these different kinds of people to become part of the Albuquerque family. It made that transition, which is never easy from a village to a city, uh, much easier. Pete decided to take the next logical step. The first office he ran for was uh, for governor of the state of New Mexico, and he ran against Bruce King, and he got clobbered. And that was a terribly wrenching evening. For me, that night after the election was so deflating, we came home and for some reason all the beds were full except for one twin bed. And I remember sleeping in that twin bed and crying. Bruce did an excellent job and you get right down to it. Pete didn't stay discouraged for long and decided to run for the Senate. I remember so clearly two years prior to that when he didn't win the governor's race, and we were all gathered, and these big tears were coming down his eyes, and, and he was, you know, sad and yet understood what had occurred. And then two years later, when he won the Senate race, he was still crying, and he says to the mass of people that was there, two years ago you saw tears of a totally different thing. He said, I am so grateful and so appreciative, and I will be your good senator. I want to close by just suggesting one thing. If that hearing said anything, it, it, it said that there really ought not be 
competition between sources. We need all kinds of energy. Coal should not be opposed to nuclear and vice versa. Senator Pete Natural Domenici gas, ends his fine. day committed to achieving his vision of a new energy policy for the nation. A couple of questions. Yeah, what do you need, guys? I need a sign here. Okay, go ahead. Could I ask you about Anwar and in the budget process? As he has so often in his career, he challenges his fellow senators and the nation to imagine something new and dare to change. To me, it's a combination of you know, integrity and character and grace. And that really captures his undying faith, his commitment to, to a family, and to the boldness and, and visionary leadership that we are the beneficiaries of every day on the floor of the United States Senate. He's uh, served our state uh, longer than anyone in, our, in the history of our state in the U.S. Senate. And uh, I think that uh, that that's understandable when you when you see the uh, dedication that he brings to the job. Well, he's been a conspicuous and lasting influence on the Senate and those of us who've served here. I think we're all better because of his service in the Senate and his example. I put my head to it. I do it. Sometimes I feel great about what I have done. Sometimes I don't. Sometimes I'm very critical of what I didn't do and how I didn't achieve what I wanted. And that's probably okay. Probably good for you. You see some national issues that are that you can really get involved in and feel comfortable with and, and say, if I get them done, I've changed something. To get from, from a great scientist the idea about the federal government pushing the mapping of the human genome, staying involved long enough in fiscal matters to get a couple of balanced budgets. The people you get to meet and the people you get to, to hire and see do big things. They're both very important. I think I want my legacy to be that I uh, had no uh, motives other than to be uh, uh, the best senator for New Mexicans that I could be. The senator from New Mexico, Pete Domenici. This Caloris program is available on home video cassette for $19.95 plus shipping and handling. To order, call 1-800-328-5663.